Uh, the top nifty loser today is HCL Technology. The stock is down 1.5% as the company is likely to lose revenues from one of its clients. So here is the development. State Street is one of the top 15 clients of HCL Tech, so a strategically important company. And they have said that they want to insource their BPO operations. Earlier, State Street and HCL Tech had formed a joint venture, which went back to, you know, it was started in 2012. Mm -hmm. So all the BPO work of State Street was done by this particular JV. Now what State Street has said is that we want to acquire HCL's stake in this joint venture. Mm -hmm. And therefore, that entire joint venture, that captive center, will be owned by State Street. And therefore, uh, the revenue which HCL Tech used to get from this particular JV will no longer be there. The numbers that we're talking about is $97 million as of the current year, mm -hmm. which is about 0.8%. So next year, assuming the growth, it will be an impact of about 60 to 80 basis points on the top line. Now, State Street will compensate HCL Tech for this loss of uh, revenues, right? For acquiring yeah. that their stake in the JV. Uh, and HCL Tech would receive about $170 million plus the net book value on the date of closing as a part of this uh, arrangement that they have. And this will be effective first quarter of FY25. But remember, this will impact only the BPO revenues that the company would get from State Street. State Street will continue to remain their client in IT services. But again, we're still talking about a net revenue impact of about 60 to 80 basis points, which is what um, you know has um, hurt the stock in today's trade. Yeah, all right, down around 1.7% on HCL Tech.